Alrighty, we're going to run from the clean out behind the water heater after cleaning and see what we have. Here's the transition from cast iron inside the house to outside the house. Looks like it's clay. Here's some major separation and root intrusion at this transition. We'll go further and see the rest of the pipe. Here's another ma major root intrusion. Snake is unable to get roots at the top of the line due to gravity and the way the snake works. Recommend outside cleanouts in a hydrojet. Alrighty, here's a city tap at roughly 84, 85 feet. We'll pull back and get a better view on the pipe. There are multiple root intrusions. Recommend installing outside clean out. 
for better access so we can use larger blades and clear the line better. All right, if you look at the top of the screen, just below the date, you can see roots hanging down. Looks like a possible break in line. I'm going to locate this outside. Okay, located the spot in the yard. It is just on the edge of the sidewalk and driveway, the southwest corner of the lot. Alrighty, I'm going to go out and locate this spot as well. Alrighty, this spot is pretty much middle of the driveway. We're going to pull back more and try and see if we can locate a spot that is not in concrete in the yard. I'm going to see where this is in the yard. That would be a perfect spot. Yeah, or just right before it or whatever. This was not quite far enough. Still in the concrete. I'm going to pull back more to try and get into the yard. I'm going to locate this spot. Hopefully it's in the yard. 
Alrighty, so this spot was in the yard just in front of the front porch steps between the steps and the driveway. Roughly five and a half feet deep. This is where I would recommend installing outside access due to there not being concrete in the way. Alrighty, that's the end of it. Everything is open and draining. There are multiple root intrusions, and I do recommend installation of outside cleanouts and a hydrojet to further inspect the pipe.